you must, like 100% must take the Shinkansen to Rishakuji Temple at Yamadera for this glorious view and Jinzan Onsen in the summer. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell to get my full itinerary for the entire north of Japan. The plan requires you to know all the train schedules, but you'll be fine by following my itinerary in the description. Take the local train from Sendai to my first stop, Rishakuji Temple, also known as Yamadera. Situated high above the mountains, like up here. Make sure to visit first thing in the morning, otherwise it can get too hot. The walk is so calming and so revitalizing with many greeneries along the way. We took roughly an hour to reach the top. Explore the temples and do whatever you like. But make sure you reach the highest spot with a view of the entire town and mountain landscape. After the morning exercise, we had lunch at the scenic restaurant close by. The Japanese restaurant's name is in the description. Get the handmade soba and regional yam dish called Imoni. Yummy! Don't forget to get some Fumotoya cherry ice cream. For Shinkansen in this region, it is crucial to plan your train journey ahead and reserve the Shinkansen tickets. Just follow my schedule in the description below to arrive smoothly to Ginzan Onsen. For information, the bus is not included in the pass and is a little bit pricey. Jinzan Onsen in the summer is as pleasant and as majestic as in the winter. We really took our time here to soak in all the views and atmosphere. The sound of the river is so relaxing, makes us wonder what our life would be away from the city. We had lunch at Takimite, famous for handmade soba and breathtaking view of Shirogane Falls. A treat to the palate, and the eyes. One million percent recommend Jinzan Onsen and this restaurant. We definitely be back here in the winter. Since we are in the Yonezawa region, we have to try the world famous Yonezawa Wagyu. Stop at Yonezawa station and walk to Bekoya. The place has a very traditional vibe. During lunchtime is the best time to visit. But dinner time is the second best. Look at the beef. It's literally pink. Oh my god, so intriguing. And the taste is subtle and lean compared to our previous Kobe Wagyu experience of the same marbling grade. A really good experience. 10 out of 10 must eat if you are in the region. For the night, we took the Shinkansen to Koriyama Station because we can head straight to the unique Aizu Wakamatsu Prefecture on day 12. What a day! See you tomorrow!